ロバートーおおほなんバトルレベルアップそうまいすわですゲッテンポインスローコイクあにとんだスピーカーさジェスティスミッジウッビーアプリシエイディおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおお<laughs> I am she knob. This wall looks a little sus. I was a oh never mind. I was gonna say something stupid <laughs> as usual. <laughs> nice and I was waiting for your golden comment. <laughs> I'm in, sir, made of gold. He's ripping a lot. Oof. Um, yeah, dude, I, as, well, I'm pretty no, sure. I get to die twice, so I'm not, like, dead dead. <laughs> God. <laughs> Is the screen being off-center a little bit bother you? No, not at all. Okay. Um. I mostly play games windowed. Yeah, so, I also deal with the acid reflux, and it's ass. I used to have weird burps that felt like I was fucking burning. Yeah. What sucks about mine is that it always wakes me up. I can, like... If I was gonna have acid reflux... At least let you sleep? Like, yeah, like, I'd rather just be walking around throughout the day and, like... Not throughout the entire day, but it's like, oh, here's two hours of acid reflux. Acid reflux. <laughs> Um, and I'd rather just deal with it, like, up front, rather than, like, going to sleep, waking up, coughing, feeling like I'm throwing up and shit. Dude, I hate that sleep time acid reflux. And then, like, the whole Ooh. next day, like, everything you eat and drink just feels sour. It sucks so bad. I have found this, um, oddly enough, um, there is something that helps and sometimes it works better than Tums for me it's uh, cough drops something about the little bit of whatever they put in it it, it really does help is it time for science? <laughs> yeah like I think it's probably like the little bit of like the sugar syrup stuff they make it out of so the thing about cough drops is like part of what makes them work is that like it helps cover your throat and like that itchy feeling you get before like you feel like you're about to throw up that's your body essentially protecting your throat so when you're about to throw up like that's why your neck or your throat feels like it's on fire because it's trying to protect your like throat from like stomach acid and shit right so cough drops like cover that so your body's like mm, no there's nothing here we don't have anything to send up because those signals are already like yeah fucking, yeah it's weird how it works and i don't mean sour i mean like it burns like everything you eat's just like Ugh. but um the um yeah co cough drops really do help uh, especially if you got the honey lemon ones sitting around that helps my acid reflux a lot. I reach for those before I reach for the damn Tums anymore, really. I just feel like they taste the best, I'm not gonna- <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh man, it just reminds me of the good old days, I guess, when you when you think you're like, or the, the days where you could bring like cough drops to school and not have like the school police called on you. <laughs> you calling me out right now? Oh, did that actually happen to you? Yes, that did happen to me. Oh. <laughs> um. I went to school. It was shortly after I got over a cold. Mm-hmm. And, um. 
I handed one of my friends was like, "Oh, you got candy?" I was like, "No, nah, I got cough drops." And he was like, "Can I get one?" I was like, "Sure." So I handed him one, and then somebody went straight to the principal and said I was selling pills. And the kicker of it is I was in fucking fifth grade. And so from fifth to eighth grade, I was like. I was in school drug counseling, where basically once a week I had to go meet with a counselor and they would talk to me about the dangers of drug use and are my parents giving me drugs or leaving pills out <laughs> once a fucking week. And then I got to high school and started actually doing drugs in school, they fucking care. Okay. That's how it works. You, you good? Yeah, I saw a print on the back of your mic and I was like, do we really got this man's mic set up backwards? Oh, like to where yeah. the Audio Technica like is on the back side yeah. versus the front. Like, no, it says back right here. Yeah, it do. I'm dumb. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> because it goes on the back side. You still haven't had a conversation with Streamlabs? Ah, oh, shit. Dude, it is. <laughs> you know what? I have been looking forward to this since like Monday. Because my God, has it been a stressful week? Yeah. Yeah. Anything in particular besides that, like tax assignment, you know? Yeah, the tax assignment was pretty killer, but like, um, I found out I'm not doing so hot in my in one of my classes, and so I'm eavesdropping. Oh, uh, <laughs> so I found out I wasn't doing so hot in my investments. Class. Only choice is to use fire. See, they give hints. I feel like fire is what you need to bring against. Whatever's coming up, I guess. It's probably the ogre. And it's this professor's teaching style. Oh shit. No worries. Just right. <laughs> this this professor's teaching style is to um tell you something and then go on a rant about how you need to learn this. It has to be habit. You can't just look at it and say, oh, I know how this works now. You have to learn it. Guys, if you do not learn this, you will not pass the class. And then he goes on and he's just like, the issue is you guys don't learn anything. You just read it. None of you here learn anything. So it's a bunch of like berating, pestering, Borderline insulting. Just to say... And, and, and the worst part is, is like, let's say it's an equation. Oh, yes! <laughs> if it's an equation, it'll already be on the board and answered, and you can take it, write it down, move on to the next thing. But he's got to spend like six minutes insulting you, saying that you're not smart enough to sit here and actually learn it. You just read it and wait for a test, and all this other stuff. And it gets to a point where, like, and this is through Zoom, and he'll start doing that. And there was one time I didn't mute my mic, and I was like, oh, my fucking God. And he was like, hello, did you need to say something? I was like, oh, my bad. I muted myself. <laughs> as soon as he starts that rant, I just put my pencil down. I'm like, oh, this motherfucker, please shut up. Just teach me the class. I'm here for an hour a day, three times a day. And you spend like 10 minutes a day teaching us. But at the same time, I think he knows that. Because he'll... He'll like... Wait until the very end and do an assignment. So he's like, oh, I know people are gonna wanna leave. Oh no. If I get yeeted off the edge. Woo. I'm a shinobi! Did he hit you with that suplex? He did. But it's okay, because I'm a shinobi. You see that ogre? Yeah. That's Zack. Aww. I don't want to hurt Zack. He'll give him a big kiss. He just looks slightly, you know, upset. Which, given through, you know, what the man's going through right now, I can't blame him, you know? Yeah. Zack is the ogre in, uh... Sekiro is, um, is that the guy's name? Yeah, so the wolf is, uh, Acid Reflux. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's a creepy pasta. Look at his red eyes. Oh my. <laughs> what 
is this? Andre the Giant? Like fucking revive? Oh, rip, rip. But we died twice, baby. <laughs> oh. Oh, I have no more fuck. Dude, use my strategy when I fought him. Run around in circle. <laughs> and then uh, just come up and hit him one time. And then run again. Whoop! There you go. Whoop! Oh my goodness! Off the top fucking rope? <laughs> you gotta be quicker than that! Stupid. Are you dumb, stupid, or dumb? <laughs> y'all finished or y'all done? <laughs> he just gives you the people's elbow. I love it. Honestly. Watch out, watch out, watch out! <laughs> Ooh. Which way are you going, big man? Come on. What? Hmm. <laughs> Nose itch bad. Ah! He's coming after you like you got the last uh, red stick at Olive Garden. <laughs> Bro, they got more in the back. Like fucking shit. That's a that's a thirty eight year old mom coming after you. After you just drank the last bit of wine. Whoop! Whoop! What? Almost. Bye. Dunzo. Dunzo. Whew. That's first try. That's first try, baby. <laughs> Damn, did you see that, that <laughs> motherfucking hog he had on him? <laughs> like, damn, bro, you worried about the wrong sword. Anyways. <laughs> Yeah, Jesus Christ. What? Nothing. My, okay, so like, the thing is, I, it takes more battery, but I have the, I know, 21st century bombs. Um, my watch like monitors my heart rate and it just like vibrated and like, I looked at it and it was like, are you stressed right now? Try breathing exercises. I'm like, mm, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Chandler, that's you. Oh, why would you do that to yourself? Sometimes <laughs> it'd be like that. That gosh damn hobgoblin. I'm glad I. This is the only time I'll hit the McCary counter today, so I hope that's recorded. I'm gonna clip that. <laughs> Sometimes you clip that. You're only getting one. <laughs> You're only getting one McCary counter all day. Who just leaves these gourd seeds out here? Dude, that's an extra sip though. I'm going back. Hold on. <laughs> uh, extra sips. Extra sips. I think the next boss is the um. <laughs> this is accent. Oh, you counter now. Yeah, yeah. Think now, now I counter right. <laughs> I think the next boss that one guy that's just sitting all by himself in a courtyard, but also has snipers up on the building. I... Waiting to take you out like you're JFK in a convertible. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean he counters now? I countered plenty last stream, right? Guys? <laughs> no? <laughs> I think the game might be skipping because part of the screen is on a 144 hertz monitor. I'm gonna try moving it over, see if that helps it. Lynn, slide me over. Slide me to the right. Like I'll slide you. Like we're doing the fucking cha-cha slide, you know? Here we go. Oh, and I'm able to move, right? Ugh. Where is she? I need to give her my seed! Sorry if y'all seen my ass, you'll have to see the rest of it on OnlyFans. Oof. 
How much you charge? Like five dollars. Like five bucks. What if there's a tier in someone's OnlyFans where it's just like request an yeah. item I insert in myself and walk around for an entire day with? Would you do it? No, I. Well, it depends on how much money they were giving me. I guess it also depends on the object. <laughs> Both of those things. We have standards. <laughs> Here's nine grand, and I just sent a childhood toy of mine from from when I was obsessed with Mickey Mouse as a kid. Right to your P.O. box. At least it's, I mean, it could be like a train or something. So walk around with this in your P.U. box. <laughs> <laughs> Gamer moment. Epic alert. Epic. <laughs> It's crazy how they built all these buildings outfitted for a grappling hook. It's like they knew <laughs> that one day a shinobi was gonna have to travel through here. Did you see how slow that guy got up? He was done with this shit for the day. He saw his friend get stabbed and he goes, uh, kinda hope I don't survive this. <laughs> Alright, we gotta be... Oh, that's right. Three sips now. Oh yeah, here's the guy. I all I this is where I quit at. Um, in fact, you've already beaten a boss that I didn't play. So I went straight to Ogre, and then here, and I was trying to travel around and get rid of these guys before I even fought the guy in the center. All I need is this leaf to survive as a shinobi. That worked out so much better in my- Oh my goodness. Alright. Oh, does he have oh. one too? Does he have a blicky? Oh! Oh, right in the armpit. You know? Oh, hold on. There's the deflect. Uh. Nope, he's got two health bars. We're gonna. That's why they call. That's why he calls a sword the old spice. <laughs> what? You, you stood in his face and said, "I bet you won't." <laughs> <laughs> and then he called your bluff. Ooh. What the fuck is that? Oh, she's letting everybody know. Well, she can shush. Ya mousy. I don't know if, like, Japanese has soft CH sounds or not, so I might be butchering this. Some anime fan in the comments can let me <laughs> know if it's Oh, they have CH sounds. Yeah. Yeah. Cause I watched uh, Kenshin with subtitles, and they always say Kenshi. Alright, now where's... Big Man? There he is. So you're telling me somebody came in here, killed all of his com comrades... ...and then because you crouched long enough, he's like, oh yeah, he must have left. <laughs> No need for alarm, <laughs> of course. Pretty much. No reason to worry. I already go. But I know you can't do it twice in a row. Oh, I, there he is. After he got stabbed, he's on fucking high alert now. I mean, wouldn't you be? I mean, fair? Oh, that was a good deflect. There we go. I like how he just shoulders you. No. Oh, that doesn't look good. I think the last boss did... Really? Let's go! <laughs> For anybody who may have watched my pathetic attempt at... Um, uh, playing Sekiro. Knows how many times I died at that. 
Over a year ago now. Oh, nice. <laughs> that was the infamous stream Carson did a bad thing. Oh, that's why they can't watch it now. Well, no, it was before I started recording streams. There's, there's two main ones, well, three main ones I wish I would have recorded had I had the hindsight. That would have been Final Fantasy X, because Innova was the only one in chat, but I was really sick at the time, mm -hmm. around last November, and uh, I decided I was going to stream anyways. Oh, nice. And um, I was trying to get Titus's Celestial Weapon. Right. And um, part of that is doing the Chocobo races. Yeah. <laughs> and I was doing the Chocobo races. Um, and I was just screaming at the game, sneezing, sniffling, just being like, ugh, ugh, I fucking hate this. <laughs> <laughs> just the whole time, not a good time. Yeah. And I actually did the uh, lightning bolt dodge on stream. Oh, nice. Mm-hmm. And you didn't record that? Well, that was before I was recording. I was like, I don't... My head was different then. I thought, well, if nobody's watching it here, why would they watch it on YouTube? I say with, like, thousands of views later on the YouTube. I wouldn't say thousands. Almost a thousand views. Here you go. Oh, that's true. What? Who saw me here? I... So I heard something funny today. What was, was this funny thing? There's a there's a podcast that no longer runs that I like to go back through once in a while mm -hmm. called Sleepy Cabin. And he was they were talking about how those rich people well not even rich people, there was there was one rich guy, he like he had a black Lamborghini and he dressed up like Batman and he would go to uh hospitals and visit sick children. Okay. And um he was he got pulled over at one point and people the, the that little video went viral where he where there's like Batman parting on the side of the road talking to a cop. Um and someone brought up they were like what if it was what if it was the dark knight Batman that went in there? So he just rushes up, grabs a kid by the shirt, pulls him <laughs> close and goes, Where is the cancer? <laughs> Where is it? Where is the cancer? Jeez. Where is it? Oh yeah, you have to smoke like 20 packs before you get on set. Where is the geyser? Oh, is this where you have to dodge the big snake? Yes it is. Nice! Zach, you're Sekiro and the snake is my pee pee. <laughs> <laughs> Just running away. No, I don't want it. Getting cold. Oh, he knows I'm here. Yes, yes he does. Okay, that was the wrong way. That was the wrong way. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I guess I did beat the last guy because I got past this part, and then there was a. And it's... Or Mr. Shinobi, excuse me. What is the difference? Listen. What shinobis do? They listen? Oh! <laughs> That's also shinobi tradition. <laughs> Look, if I wave it fast enough, it looks like it is elastic. See? Yeah, you know, the little pencil thing all those kids did in like Whoa, elementary school. Oh, it's wavy pencil. Dude, I want whatever that item is, but he's kind of losing his shit. Uh. Oh, look, look at my sword. It's made of rubber. So I just say fuck it and not like. <laughs> Do we go for the green? Yes. All right, bet. <laughs> I went over there for a seed. 
Oh, the seeds are actually helpful for the lady butterfly party. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. You look like a hot dog when someone asked for to them to for them to put a ketchup <laughs> on it. But then they put a singular ketchup onto the hot dog. That is you. So I'm not a fully dressed hot dog. <laughs> yeah, first try. <laughs> Why is fully dressed hot dog so entertaining to you? I don't know, man. We were talking about um hot dogs. No, we were talking about <laughs> if uh, we just had to do one call as male prostitutes, like, and it would just be this one time, and you'd get like a few million dollars, and um, and I said, no, nah, I'd probably get something weird where like some old guy is like, here's a fully dressed hot dog. <laughs> I'm gonna eat it I out of you. I don't know why fully dressed and, a hot dog like gets And I was like, and that gets put in you, and then he eats it or whatever. And Zach was like, oh, dude, you gross, huh? And then Chandler goes, what's a fully dressed hot dog? <laughs> <laughs> like, he's been stuck on that shit. <laughs> I'm like, you know, that's, that's the term for when you take a hot dog and you put, like... All I'm saying is I've never been to Sonic, right? And they're like, oh... What do you want on your coney? And I'm like, mm, I want it fully dressed. Like I've <laughs> well, but when you get it and it's got like the pickle spear on it and some other stuff, and it's like what you have then is a fully dressed hot dog. Well, see now I know. So when I go to Sonic now, I'm fucking prepared to order a coney correctly. <laughs> well, I guess like you could apply that to anything. Like if you got a hamburger with like all the toppings you want on it. You could call it a fully dressed hamburger. Oh, there's a big boy over there. Bro, he been eating them peaches and cream. Dude, he wants my peaches. That bitch wanna try my brand new hot dog. My fully dressed hot dog. Yo, he is chafed as fuck in there. Baby powder, my dude. That shit will help you. I mean, it looks like it's, you know, kind of warm outside. With the snow. <laughs> <laughs> does it even snow in Japan? Oh, yeah, it does. They're further north than we are. <laughs> hey, I don't know my... <laughs> I don't know all my geographicals. Geographicals, all of them. Yeah. All of them. All of the geographicals. How is everyone doing in the Twitchoverse tonight? I guess we're just good at being sneaky today. I don't. <laughs> yeah, like you're fucking killing it tonight. Oh, it's because, and I think Zach made a comment on it last stream. Is like. I think I put all the skills into stealth, honestly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who so, needs combat skills? So you just jump in front of somebody and they go, Who's there? <laughs> Where is he? They're like looking right at me. Like if, as long as you don't make a move, they can't see you type shit. Aw, poor guy's mourning his horse. But he's also telling you something important. Horses don't like gunpowder. Ah. Uh. You ever feel guilty about shit like that in games where someone's like, oh no, this happened and he's also your enemy, but you're like, man, I didn't mourn the horse. Well, he let the horse die, so I said, fuck it. That is the name of my new pop punk band, Mourn the Horse. <laughs> 